Boy Sting 1981, another uh, unboxing video. I got a few things going on. Uh, today I'm just going to touch base on a few uh, products that I got from my helicopters. I'm kind of wrapping this one up because uh, my 550 here is good to fly. It's got everything on it ready to go. Uh, my 700, it's not where the 550 is. It needs to get serviced yet. So it's going to be everything to wrap up and tie in every, both my helicopters except servos for my, my 700 and that's going to be where this one's at. Uh, so today, I'm going to just take a quick minute and give a few uh, moments of uh, shout out. So uh, I have a mod I'm doing. So this is from Nitro Kyosho and uh, really good mod. He came up with a cooling idea on YouTube and I'm just pointing it out. This is, uh, this is carbon fiber wrap. Uh, no, it's not real carbon fiber. It's just tape. Uh, gives a nice look. I'm going to do the pill bottle trick. You get a very large uh, uh, vitamin bottle. You just do the pill bottle over your motor, drop it on, you put a fan on it, call it a good day, you wrap this up, you know, you, you take the, you know, you peel off the labels and stuff and soak it overnight in water or whatever. If you want to know and learn more about that trick, just look up my trick, Kyosho, all in one word as it sounds, and you'll find that link in there for his, uh, his cooling mod trick for the, uh, the motors. For uh, 700 and uh, I think it's 550 size and 700 size and up uh, heli, so anywhere that meets that criteria. So moving on, I'm going to do that. This is, like I guess, one thing I'm out of the way with. So that's the tape mod uh, for the uh, pill bottle trick. So this one here is from Eric. So Eric from Medusa Heli, appreciate it as always. I already pre-opened this, so it didn't come this way when I got it. I already built these. They come, they come in pieces. These are Align 700, 800 size linkages, the ones that come on my, my 700, which is the one over here on this side, uh, opposite of my 550. It doesn't have the, uh, the right linkages on it, so I went ahead and did a swap on those. So again, thanks Eric for that. Uh, good, good pricing on those as well, as always. Thank you. Uh, another thing that came in, this is from, uh, this is from uh, where Nitro Kyosho and a couple other guys up north are from. This is over, I think, in... I think, I think I want to say in Philly, Philadelphia. Uh, this is over in uh, Heli Direct, so I think that's out his way or out by. I think he lives in Maine, but he buys a lot of things from uh, from Heli Direct. This is going to be a saddle pack I'm putting on my 700, so this is going to be sealed in the bag. It's a saddle pack, and what that does is it allows external reading of battery usage and allows me to auto rotate my helicopter down if I get a brownout. So it, it runs all my servos and stuff on this. So it's not relying on all my servos and stuff that are running on the helicopters to be running on just solely uh, the main packs. Uh, this will not be going on my 550. This will be going on my Big Bird, which is going to be the other one. It's going to be this guy right here. And I got a very cool strap. I think this is from Dan. So Dan from, uh, if I got that right, so Dan, I believe that is. Uh, Heli Direct. Invoice. So that's a battery strap. You strap it down to your frame. The invoice. Uh, I don't know if it was Dan or not. I, I know I've got a Heli Direct invoice sheet. So, fellas at Heli Direct. I don't have a name on that one, so guys at Heli Direct, thank you. Uh, put your name out so I get more people getting involved in everything. So, uh, my mistake. So that was from Heli Direct. Uh, so whoever it is from Heli Direct uh, gave me all those things for a good price. I think I was under about I think uh, about 25 bucks. Uh, they wanted 30. I got them down to about 25. Called it a day. It's a nice battery. It's a lithium powered uh, battery. It's good. Now here's the big one. This one comes from Dan Botchnik. This is a guy off of uh, eBay. He, I guess he's, he's a hobby place that sells a bunch of batteries. Uh, this guy is who I was thinking I got the other battery from, but it was from uh, Heli Direct. This one here is not Heli Direct. This one here is an actual store. I'm just trying to get this done so I can get see how these came out. I waited all week to try to get to these because 
they're really heavy and I didn't get a chance to look at them. I've been busy with bike stuff and bike week and wrapping up everything with bike week in Daytona Beach. So there you go. Got Jen's aces for you. Um, I'm not going to touch on too much about it. It's just big lithium power polymer bricks. Um, these weigh pretty pretty hefty here. These are probably coming in in the packaging at about mm, about three about three to five pounds for both of these. These are about three to five. Yeah, so these are these are good. Ah, about three pounds. Weighs down the bird a little bit here. Um, they're taped, so they're sealed. They're a sealed unit. Yep, you see the tape on it. Yep. Sorry, my nose is a little sniffly. I hope it don't cut in your video. If it does, I apologize in advance. No worries here. It's been cold. It's been it's been warm for most of the week, and we're just now starting to get into some rain in the last few days. So, uh, like I said, bike week's wrapping up in Daytona Beach, so I haven't had time to do much of anything uh, with all the festivities going on in Daytona. So, and today is St. Patrick's Day, so everybody out there. TV World out on YouTube. Happy St. Patrick's Day. I got green so you can't pitch me. Uh, your hellies are green, but you're not wearing green, so that means like later on I can pinch you if I want to. Ha 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 ha. Oh, well, then you better put it on then. I'm wearing it. You're good. <laughs> so, that's each one. I'm going to take one out so you guys can see. These look unused. Uh, nice battery. Um, these va these factored in at 188 and change for both. Uh, these these run about 200 a piece retail. So I'm looking at it between uh, two, roughly about 200 a battery. Uh, they uh, sometimes they can retail for. I've, I've heard them up to 300 bucks a piece. So I don't know how how true that is, but these are very expensive. Um, these are gonna run. In, these gonna run just like this. So they'll be just like that. Well, here's the side panel. So you have them just like this. And you have your wires come out on either end. And they get met up with a T connector. So I've got a T here. I got one going this way. And I got one going on the other side. I got a T connector coming off my speed controller. So you got one here. I got one on the other side. And it goes into a single up in the nose. Um, Good luck with that one. <laughs> So, for some of you guys that don't understand what I'm talking about, single branched into a into two. So you got one there and one there, and they're going to run both of your batteries. It's called series. And what that does is that puts an output of power onto the heli. Running, well, in this in this instance, I'm running twice the load needed for this helicopter. So all said and done pretty uh, amount, a decent amount of power going to these. Um, I decided, like I said again, I'm going to run a separate battery uh, for my larger helicopter and these are going to be both being ran on both on both helicopters. And eventually I'm going to be going into pulse batteries to match the 5002S that I have for my receiver pack, but for right now uh, that's pretty much that. So I've got my linkages, I've got my carbon fiber tape that I did for the uh, to reference for the mod I'm going to probably end up doing and for that mod it's just going to be a pill bottle an oversized one as large as I can or roughly and it's going to be fitting right over top of the motor I'm going to have a fan going on top of it and it's called a good day um, if you guys have any questions please rate comment subscribe I uh, don't have anything else really for content right now on the helicopters that's pretty much it until I get some servos you guys can get a good look at what's going on that's Yeah. What I got going there on right we go. Now. So I've got two nice batteries, two big bricks. They're going up in the helicopter soon. This will be the first one to fly. Mm -hmm. uh, everything else is pretty much uh, good to go. Um, you know, again, I, I, as far as content on the helicopter, is pretty much going to conclude that until I get servos for my other one. And I, will, guys, will keep you uh, posted on what's going on with that. Uh, other, other things going on right now that I have on the channel. I've got stuff going on with my car. I haven't gotten a chance to get to that yet. I've also touched on in the, in the past, I uh, did some backtracking and I've got a couple of controller videos I've done where I've done some, some controllers and I'm going to get that out soon. Uh, so look forward to that in the next up and coming episode. So 
uh, this is going to put me uh, pretty much at a conclusion for the helicopters until they get ready to fly. So, that being said, this is your boy, 1981 with another successful unboxing video. Please rate, comment, subscribe, and have a great one. See you on the next one. Later.